Hey guys, you're watching Daniel and Gian React, and today we're going to check out the trailer for Rangi Taranga, the official HD theatrical trailer from, I'm guessing, New Canada or New Canada. Um, we got no background on this film, so we're just going to jump in blind and let's do it. That's impossible. That was a cool move. What's the difference, though? Why would you want to get married underwater? Because she wants Super to be romantic. a mermaid, bro. Oh. It's, it's her childhood fantasy to be married as a mermaid. Disney movies, man. Oh no, she's from Kamarutu. I don't know what that means. I'm just Me kidding. Either. This is pretty. What what uh what part of the country is this in? Oh no. He has a very deep voice. Hmm. Oh, this is a horror movie. I remember now. Oh. Was that a headless upside down body? It looked like it. That guy has bags under his eyes. He needs to sleep more. I'm totally confused. No art art idea. Nice dolly zoom. This looks pretty intense. I think that's the end of the trailer. This was was this a te was this a teaser? Because it's I feel like I just, I no this is a is this a, a trailer? full trailer? Yeah. I just feel like it, I wasn't getting a lot. I didn't get a lot of information from it. Right. I mean, uh, that's probably because they want to keep keeps things a you know a secret right. to reveal for so the this, story. This, is this horror or is it suspense? No, it's a horror. It's a horror film. Um, definitely different than what I'm used to when I think of horror uh, films. But you can argue the thriller is a horror film too because it's scary. Being yeah. a thriller is a scary situation. So, something that keeps you at the edge of your seat. Right, exactly. Um, but what did you think before I say anything? What did you think of the trailer? What did you th like? Would you be interested in watching this? Would you? Uh, I was trying to piece together what the story might be about, you know, and they keep on. The problem is, I think there's two different girls, and I was confusing the girl at the beginning. I think the girl at the beginning is the one who disappeared, and then he's there with another woman, and they go to this house. Right. And they're accusing him. Of killing the other girl? Of, of killing the other girl. Her body's disappeared. We don't know where she's at, you know. But then we see that body hanging upside down right. on the head, um, which is pretty brutal, by the way. was not expecting that in a trailer. That was a lot. That was heavy. Um, but, uh... I don't know. It was cool. It's different for me. I I I, uh, I didn't have a problem with the trailer per se, but I'm I'm more curious to watch this film just because I'm curious to know what the difference is between an Indian horror film and the conventional American horror film. Right. Because uh, there's a lot of tropes in American and horror that are copied uh, in other genres, but there's. There's a reason why American slasher films were American slasher films. I'm not saying this is one, but Americans bred that horror genre, that killer 
menacing genre. Yeah. So I'm definitely curious to know the spin on it. Uh, because well, at the end, you see the image where he's got his like his eyes a different color. And he's got that right kind of pain on his face. So I'm wondering if there's like a split personality thing going exactly. on. Exactly, I was thinking of that too. Uh, um, remember that? that or he, they they that got Robert married. De Niro and Dakota Fanning movie. Uh, no. I know what you're talking about. I've never yeah. seen it, though. I know what you're talking about. Spoiler alert. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. But, um, but, but you know what? The, the, the other thing is, though, the reason why I'm so curious to know if there's a, this, this layover is when I was watching this, I didn't feel afraid. Yeah. I actually felt like I was watching a B movie, like a B horror film. And so I'm curious to know if this is a B movie, and I don't mean any insult by it, but I'm just saying, like, I felt like... Things were a little more heightened than they normally would be. Like I felt like it was over, not over the top per se, but it was just a little bit sensationalized. What about what about the the quality of the picture? What about the image quality looked good? And what about the camera work? The camera, some of the camera. The, the camera move was good. Like yeah. I said, I, I enjoyed the. There was two shots that I pointed out. That first one that kind of started from the side and it went straight, which, you know, as a film person you might think oh you know his world was disjointed and then it came to balance like there's reasons why you move the camera and then I really appreciated the dolly zoom at the end which for those who don't know is when the camera pushes in but it zooms out at the same time so like the character looks the same but the background changes and there's this weird subtle effect that you feel on the inside but anyway so I, I appreciated that I, it's no it's nothing about that it's more about the story I'm just curious if it's supposed to be grounded and realistic or it's this heightened because you know you, you watch like texas chainsaw massacre exactly like texas chainsaw massacre no one in the story is normal except for the the people that you follow yeah like everyone else is weird there's a weird vibe about the town because they bring up the town here you're new to this town so like i wonder if all these people are crazy or what's going on here right again i'm curious to know it's, it's, this isn't me talking uh talking bad about it i did have one issue with the audio though it all felt dubbed yeah, it all felt dumb. like so none of it felt was, uh, normal. We're gonna ask natural. you guys like the 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 way they were talking. It, they look like overdub. So was this recorded in a different language, and that was, or did they just have really bad audio on set? And I mean, that, just that could be it too. It. You know, like this this more than other things we've watched. Like you could definitely tell it was overdub, like ADR going on. And the reason why the, the the big reasons you can tell is like people have things in their hands or they're hitting the desk, but you don't and, hear it. Yeah, you just hear the dialogue, which means that they re-recorded it later and placed it on there. Which I can talk about in another review in the future, as you know, one of my little cutaways. But again, thanks for thanks for recommending this. Uh, please send more horror stuff because I'm, I'm I want to I just want to know what it's like uh, overseas for sure because I'm just so used to American slasher. And tell us which films. ones you want us to actually review too, like actually watch. Because and yeah, not just the trailer, but yeah. actually watch. Um, anyways, guys, that'll do it for us. You know the drill: hit that like, that subscribe, that bell, leave comments, let us know what you think. And uh, check out some of our other reaction videos right over here. And we'll see you soon. Thanks for watching.